unlock a whole new world of games and adventures with UB Funkies. We have eight new Funkies! Hay que comprarse un muñequito así blanquito. Today I'm going to be unboxing the UB Funkies starter pack. <coughs> Welcome to a uh, a weird little insight to my childhood. It's I don't know. It's kind of weird. Now, uh, UB Funkies is a uh, a game that sits kind of like in a weird spot in my memory. It's like one of those things that I won't think about for years, and then like some random thing happens that makes it like pop up and then when it pops up I start going like crazy because I like am like shocked that I haven't thought about this thing that was such a big part of my childhood you know it's like I remember going to Walmart with my dad and like picking out a UB Funky and like freaking out wanting it so bad and I like you know it was a, it was a, a big thing when I was like so young and like it, it wasn't like a rare thing because it, it, UB Funkies is a child MMO that started in 2007 and I mean at that time that wasn't a crazy idea you had Club Penguin, Mashi Monsters, I mean those aren't crazy but you also had like Wizard 101, Toontown, you know you had all the, if you wanted a kid MMO it's not hard to find one at the time but the thing about UB Funkies is that it is very ahead of its time in the way that but it, it, it's Skylanders before Skylanders. You'd take your hub and then you'd take your figures and put it on the hub. And the whole idea in that aspect was way ahead of the time. And eventually, you'd be funky. This, it, it eventually failed. And, uh, which really sucks because, you know, you'll find people now. If, if you bring up Skylanders to somebody random, chances are they're going to know what you're talking about. But you ask one of your friends, hey, you remember you'd be funkies. They have no clue what you're talking about, or it's real foggy to them. So, you know, it hits me, and I start thinking, oh my god, I remember UB Funkies, and I, I do my research, and I found out 10 years ago this month, January 2020 now, uh, was the the month that uh, all the servers got shut down. So I just want to make this video to, you know, kind of kind of go through the memories, because UB Funkies, while seems like a lot of people don't remember it there is kind of a uh, a group on reddit of people who uh have this nostalgic little place in their heart for it and they've made a real effort to kind of bring back whatever they can from it so i got the game that they've helped bring back a single player version of it downloaded it and this is what we got today and i'm not gonna ramble any longer i'm gonna head straight into it thanks uh thank you for listening to this <laughs> okay ah <laughs> I don't, I don't know how I feel about this. It's like, uh, like having your friends over to your house for the first time, and you're like, oh god, you're gonna see all my, sh <laughs> I mean, my stuff. <laughs> no, weenie, weenie hot password. All right, y'all. You know. Ooh, kind of j jamming out though. Welcome to Funky's Town. I'm Mayor Say So, here to make sure your visit to Funky's Town is a great one. The greatest city throughout all of Terrapinia. Funky's Town is home to the Funkies. Funkies are fun loving creatures who love to create their own funky styles. Funkies are always designing new games, traveling to new lands, and creating fun things to trade with each other. This love of fun and exploration led to the creation of the portals. Powered by a series of crystal gems, the portals gave the Funkies freedom to move throughout the land at will. A guild of master technicians, under the guidance of the great Dr. Tinker, saw to the creation and maintenance of this portal system, and made sure it operated safely. That was until the great disaster. I encourage you to explore Funkies Town and beyond. See the sights, play the games, and discover all of the secrets that Terrapinia has to reveal. Alright, so... What I gathered from that is that that doctor dude looks so <laughs> creepy. Sorry, dude. he looks so creepy, dude. Orf, orf, orf. <coughs> the mail must go <laughs> through. I'm in charge of collecting the mail for the Funky's Postal Service, but I'm having some trouble. I need to pick up the mail at the Funky Key. 
well, that's post office, but ever since the great disaster, I can't travel through the Funky Key Island portal. Would you help me and retrieve the outgoing mail from the Funky Key postcard shop and bring it to me? I'll be your best friend. Oh, dude. Hell yeah. I, uh, am playing this with a uh, mod that was, uh, made and, uh, posted on the, uh, UB Funkies Reddit, which I'll, I'll have this, I'll have anything you need to download this in the description in case you want to play. Uh, it's safe. It's a small community that's, like, really into this game, so it's like, oh, god damn it. <laughs> Strange happenings are afoot in Funkystown. Overnight, a mysterious dirigible has docked at the Funkystown waterfront. It looks familiar, but no one has seen one of those, I mean, anything like it in eons. Can you investigate? I have, um, other business to attend. Okay, um, but my point is it's a, it's a small community on Reddit that's, like, really into this game, and, you know, it's, it's nostalgic for them, so they, like, put a lot of effort into recreating this. Here's the dream portal, I believe. Yeah, I'll go into that. Um, oh, okay. I wish it's a great disaster portal, so we'll certain doors. Access is denied. We truly regret any inconvenience. Unfortunately, ever since the great disaster, the portal system and certain doors have not been functioning properly. On the day of the great disaster, a series of spectacular explosions rocked Funky's Town, destroying the main portal station and shattering the crystal gems. Because the portals were open at the time, the explosion spread to many of the stations. Also lost in the explosion was Dr. Pinker, whose remains were never found. He is believed to have been walking on the main portal station when the explosion occurred. All Funkies regret the loss of our chief engineer. Ever since the great disaster, not all of the portals have operated properly. A great deal of magic was released when the crystal gems shattered. Magic that is unpredictable at best. Recovery has been slow. There is barely enough power to keep any of the portals operating. It was during this period of chaos that Master Lox mysteriously appeared and began stealing from the population through his henchmen. Using his viral powers, Master Lox locked the remaining functioning portals, as well as certain doors, restricting where a funky can travel in Terapenia. Okay, so... <coughs> I feel like... We're getting bits of this storyline and like really weird portions. Like I feel like it doesn't make sense most of the time because it's like we'll get one little snippet and then that snippet doesn't make sense until you get another one later on. This is a pretty cool little sequence we got going on here. I don't even want to start talking because now I think I'm just assuming that they're gonna have a little cutscene when I get here. Yeah, see? Welcome to the Hidden Well. I guess it's not so hidden anymore now, huh? My name is Kane, the greatest Oni warrior of all time. I'm in charge here. Well, until he gets back to this. Within these walls is the fortress home of the fiercest funkies you'll ever find. The Oni. And I don't say that just because I'm the biggest, baddest Oni there is. I say it because it's the truth. Care to test it? This fortress has been isolated from the rest of funky society since the Great Funky Wars. Some say these lands were forgotten. I think the rest of Terrapinia was just scared. We haven't had any visitors for so long. I just figured we're the only funkies left. Lately, though, that dirigible there has been dropping off strange-looking funkies, like yourself. That's fine by me, but don't think you're going to change things around here. I'm in charge. Until the king gets back, that is. So don't mess with me or I'll bring the pain. Been itching for a new fight anyway. I'm the reigning champ of the Oni Dojo, and I manage a select team of Oni fighters that has never lost. Of course, we've only fought ourselves, but undefeated is undefeated. Man, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna get my point out of the way here. I'm not doing anything till I, I'm gonna blast through this. Small community, they made this. It's offline since it got shut down 10 years ago. You don't need the hub for it. You don't need the figures for it. They aren't in production anymore, obviously. The game got shut down 10 years ago. They're not gonna keep on selling the figures for it. So since you can't buy the figures, you can't really use them for a game. So this version, you don't need the hub. You can type in the codes for whatever character you need to play as. Uh, and actually, I might actually do that now, and then go head into that JoJo. All right, here. This is this is one of the characters. How much do you want to bet? Uh, do I have any money? I have. Okay. On the count of three, choose your tile. Sword beats paper. Paper beats stone. It's rock paper scissors. Um. Okay. Epic. Oh, you just got demolished, you stupid idiot. Oh my god. Epic. So that's the dojo? Or was that that dude? Okay. 
so yeah, uh, different characters get you into different areas. Like, as you just saw, I had to be one of the characters from this realm to get into the dojo. Uh, and y you can just do different things in different areas. So, uh, play single player game. Built by the Oni to keep their Oni warriors ready for battle. Only recently has the Oni dojo been open to other warrior funkies. Do you have what it takes to be the champion of the Oni dojo? Okay. Oh, like Mortal Kombat? Oh, what the? Oh, oh my god. Oh my god. This is very not epic. Okay, duality. Oh god. <coughs> don't, don't die. Don't die. Don't die. Don't die. God damn it, do not die. Oh my god. <coughs> yeah, what? Oh yeah, he's running. That's embarrassing. Yeah, stupid. Oh, and I'm dead. You gonna do a fatality or something? You don't have to rub it in my face. This is like, oh, god damn, the most difficult e-sport in the world. Oh, oh got him. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. I just realized. Oh, god. I didn't realize that was my attack. Oh, I have ninja stars. I didn't realize. So, oh my god. I'm gonna beat this goddamn fight. Oh, uh, yes. Yeah, stupid. Okay. Yeah, you're dead. Stupid. Goddamn. Oh my god. Okay. Oh god, that's rough. Oh, he blocked it. He attacks me when I do that special move and it just demolishes me. Okay. Oh, yeah, you thought. Okay, yeah, you're done, punk. Oh, God, he's, yeah, ruined. His little, literally just ruined his reputation. And he's dead. Oh, my God, yeah, hell yeah. Look at me go. Oh, my God. Wait, what? Oh, my God, get away from me. I'm like a master at this now. I don't even have to worry. Oh, God. Okay. Ugh. 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 Okay. No, oh my god. <coughs> oh my god. Just do it. God damn. I like do the keys to do the uh, attack, but this doesn't work sometimes. Oh my god. I'm an actual legend right now. First try with that guy. First try again. Watch this. Oh, yeah. Just got demolished. Oh my god, hell yeah. Stupid, god damn. Why did I get so good at this? Oh my god. Watch this. Oh my god. Obliterated. He's never gonna come back from that. I, I just ruined that rest of his life. He will never live to be the same. Oh my god, how long is this gonna go straight up though? <coughs> Can I reach the end? Am I gonna like win all of them? There you go. Man, I'm a legend for real. Oh god. Oh, oh, yeah, he thought he was so cool. <laughs> okay, there we go. Okay. Easy. I'm just gonna. Yeah. Oh my god, I'm fighting the big man now. Watch this. I'm about to make an absolute fool out of him. Yeah, I'm about to ruin this man's whole career. Watch. Oh, got him. Oh my god, what was that? Jesus, okay. Uh, uh. Jesus Christ. My god, my god. God damn, okay. Do I get to start off with him? Or do I have to start from the beginning again? Game over. I'm not starting from the beginning again. Funky fighter trophy. Hell yeah, I did. Okay. That was a little chaotic. Really took me out of the whole thing I, I didn't expect to get so deep into something there but uh you you saw we got some stuff there so uh that kind of introduces this whole little bit where we get our own crib and I want this one yes I do god damn it now how do I decorate it the stuff there we go 
<laughs> you're not gonna lie, this soundtrack's pretty sick. This is the only couch we have so far, so it's it's gonna have to work, okay, guys? Oh, yo, these chairs are sick. I got this thing, too. That's kind of terrifying, actually. Did you get a close-up of that thing? What is going on with it? I got pets. Like, this thing really is just living. Oh my god, this thing too! It's just a brain in a jar? God! And that's supposed to be my pet? <coughs> who, <coughs> who made this? Uh, that's it for now, I guess. Uh, I'm head back to, uh, my place. Alright, it's, it's weird, I feel like for a minute there, I've been in, like, a, a spot where, like, you know, like, it, it was consistent for a second, so, like, it was nice, you know? And now it's kind of weird. Type your wish below. Alright, I feel like this is kind of just, like, a little bit. Like, there's nothing really to it. I don't know. It's cool, though, I guess. Oh, you kind of vibing, though. I mean, Kate. That worked! The gates are closed. Oh, they're gonna read it. Don't worry. <laughs> the gates are closed. Me and my boys have tried hitting him, bashing him, whacking him, and even hitting him some more. But we just can't see to get him open. So the back king Sid climbed a mountain, saying he was determined to take a look around. Says he needed to see what lay beyond the borders of the hidden realm. King Sid, though, he came back a changed funky. He immediately set up these gates. I'm not a fan of the gates. He called this the path of enlightenment, and kept mumbling something about teamwork and cooperation. Then he said that I was in charge. Close the gates, and we haven't seen him since. Doesn't make much sense to me. I mean, I have it all figured out, I can tell you. But since it's to reach enlightenment, you need to figure it out on your own. Do I need to become another funky? Okay. How about that? Oh, sick. Okay. And then, uh... Epic. So sick. Oh, that dude's kind of funky. Oh, uh, I gotta do five of them now? Excuse me! Sick. Uh, dandy. Awesome. Okay, here we go. That should be the last one. I can't imagine they're gonna have more. There's only five characters for this realm. Like, specifically. For those of you who don't know how it works, there's a bunch of different areas, and each area has specific characters that go towards it. Excuse me! Oh, what is this? Yeah, so you don't need um, only hidden realm characters to do this part. It's uh, any characters. It's I was just making an extra step, I guess. Oh my god. How much do I want to bet? Oh, a gazillion. But that wasn't a choice. Paper, easy. You think I'm a fool? It's a draw? More like it's a sword. Oh, man. More like it's a sword again. Because he wouldn't expect it. <coughs> it was actually a joke. I was just pranking you guys. But so anyways, let's go. Okay, and then, uh... <coughs> I'm really dying these days, huh? God, what's going to be at the end of this thing? It's going to be at the top of the mountain, dude. Oh, my God. What are you trying to sell me? Jesus Christ. I hate it. <coughs> yeah, no, I hate everything you have to offer, lady. Anywhere. Oh, what's that? Epic. Now, this is what I'm talking about. I'll be back here. I like this place. <coughs> Can I put this dude in the chair? Hell yeah. Yeah, I forgot to mention, uh, there is a, uh, little uh like crossover i guess you could say between ub funky and speed racer these aren't real people they're liars and fibs hot wheels they also have a hot wheel sponsorship that's pretty solid i am a very important person let me into the race i deserve better treatment than all of you all right i'm bored oh um, maybe this is the race thing? Yeah, I think this is it. I'm gonna get out on the track. Hit me. Jesus. 
Don't tell me what to do. Oh god. Oh my god, my money. So what is my goal here? Is there a way for me to win? I think there that's a timer at the top. God damn. Oh god damn it, I probably would have had that one. Okay, go, go, stupid. <coughs> god damn it. No, no, we're you're getting back in there. It's not like I can lose anything now. Oh, so the first one flies past me, but the second one doesn't? No, we're going to win this. What a weird minigame this is. I've got it. This is so good. Oh my god, I'm a legend. Still got hit by that car though. <laughs> Did literally nothing. I mean, that, winning that game is pointless. Racer Motors. Can I buy a car here? Oh, it's just car stuff for the. Oh, yeah. Damn. White Hot Wheels. Hot Wheels track set. I'm feeling somewhat let down here. There has to be a way for me to race. Is that cl cl money? Cool. Fun lesson, kids. If you ever see money on the street, make sure to go grab it real quick. Okay. World map. Can I go? Where all can I go from here? Oh, that's like this whole world. So there's so much to this one that I can explore, but do I care about it? No, I want to go back to the other one. Oh, it's this place. Come on, let's go. Hell yeah. <coughs> oh god, there's just snakes walking around and sh- Oh, that's a whole car. Look, there's a snake in the background too. I, I get that I'm welcome here. Please, get out of the way. Okay, $700 for that car. Mm, I don't know about that. Who wants all these snakes? Nobody. A pit of snakes? Who's gonna buy a pit of venomous snakes to put in their household? God damn. Nobody wants to dig a pit into their house and just fill it with venomous snakes. God damn. You're a joke. I hope you know that. Goodbye. God damn. Uh, 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 oh god. Oh god. Watch this. Whoa, 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 whoa. Aww. Hey, I won, actually. I thought I lost that one. Excuse me, I'm trying to. God damn. I just want to go home. Just kill me. I don't even care. Okay, all I wanted was to find. I need to find. Oh, so it doesn't even specifically have to be from the post office. I've been looking for a post office this whole time. Uh, ignore the fact that I'm still covered in garbage. So I just gotta go in all these different places, huh? Man, you really sting. Help can't breathe. I'm too. Excuse me, that's rude. Man. You really stink! Funkies don't typically appreciate <coughs> other filthy funkies tracking mud through their game rooms. But they don't mind if you've accumulated just a bit of road dust. Get a bit cleaner, and I have no doubt you'll again be granted access throughout Terrapinia. Oh, dear God. What will I do? This is so unfair. God damn it. We're getting through this. We're going back. 
I'm ignoring all this stuff. I'm done with everything except for that one goddamn. Where even is it? Where even is it? I'm going back to this island and I'm finishing what we started. God damn it. Excuse me. Excuse me. I know. I know. I smell like garbage. But you gotta deal with it, guys. Okay, that that I can get through this faster, actually. Okay, God damn it! I mean, through this door. Spent so much time playing this game, and I still haven't gotten through these doors yet. God damn it! Okay, I think I think the la the the next one up here is the last one. I think. Who knows what comes after that, man? Who knows? That's the long-awaited mystery of this episode. This the four goddamn doors. It's so simple, but s somehow it's taken me so long. Excuse me, Yang. Yang, get out my way. Yang, I don't want to have to kill you. Come on, Yang. Hey, get out here, bud. Get out. Because you're my friend, I'll show you mercy on this day. Just stay away from me. Stay away from that circle. Get off that circle before I have to get on it. Get away from here, Yang. Get out of my business. God damn it. Okay. Damn. There you go. Ten, ten UVs. Is that enough? Have I pleased you? Just let me in. Oh my god. Oh my god, what is that? Oh my god. I said home is it that has traveled the enlightened path? Well, is enlightenment all that you expected it to be? Maybe you just don't see what it is that you have been shown. Sit, let me tell you the tale of my people, the Oni. Long ago, in the dark times of the great funky wars, it seemed that all was lost. This place, the Perilous Verge, home of the Oni, was besieged on all sides. It seemed as if we were doomed to fall to the marauding horde of the evil King Khan. As a final effort, I had all the paths leading to the Verge destroyed, isolating my people in this fortress high atop the tallest mountain. I instructed King to release the Thousand Blur, a powerful magic that blurs and obscures, to further shield us. I cut off all contact with the other funky tribes, believing that if my tribe was to survive the horde, we would do this alone. As I would come to find, without the help of the Oni, the remaining funky tribes finally united under the great King Funkan Khan. Together, they were able to drive back the armies of Khan, bringing an end to the Funkazoic era, and began the great golden age of funkies. With the perilous verge shrouded in the Gaussian blur, and no contact from the Oni, King Funkan Khan believed the Oni had been lost to the advancing wards. The perilous verge had become a hidden realm, isolated within our walls, and hidden from the outside world. News of the war's end never reached the Oni. Believing that war still raged right outside our gate, we determined to remain vigilant and prepared. We built the great Oni Dojo, so that all of our warriors could perfect their combat skills in preparation for a great battle we knew would someday come. But constant fighting can get a bit tiresome. And as the years passed with no news from the outside world, I wondered if there was something more to this funky existence. So I climbed to the highest point of the Forbidden Realm, sat under this Bodhi tree, built this telescope, and took a look around. What I saw amazed me, and in an instant, I was a changed funky. I saw the different tribes of funkies now living in harmony. I saw the wondrous things that they had built together, and I realized that isolation was not the answer. All the prosperity, all the fighting, all the wealth did not matter if you didn't share it with others. We spent so much time keeping the armies of our enemies out, we lost sight of how to welcome our friends in. I was determined to share this realization with other funkies. But of course, you can't become if you only say what you would have done. Enlightenment cannot simply be given, it must be earned. To achieve this, I created the gates and sent my airship to Funky Town in order to connect with the remaining tribes of funkies. I hoped that those funkies who could devise how to open these gates would truly travel the path to enlightenment. So now that you've heard my tale, have you realized the enlightenment it is that you have achieved? Yes, you see it now, don't you? But each funky is different. We are all funkies, 
and only by working together can we ever hope to achieve anything truly great. D, huh? Now if I could just figure out what those confounding mysterious buttons do. <laughs> My man really just went heavy in the UB funky lore. Like goddamn. Uh, I don't know. Let's look through his telescope, maybe. What's this going on here? Ten coins. I'm so poor. I cannot afford that. Ten coins. Oh, God damn it. Grab the money. God damn. Just grab the money. Oh my God. Go grab the money. Now book it. Book it. God damn. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Oh. Okay. I just want to look at your telescope, big man. Come on, let's go. Let's do it. What are we looking at? What was that? What was that? Okay, y'all. Well, we got disgusting. We went through Speed Racer Town. We uh, got our room situation going for us. We became enlightened. I think it's a pretty solid ending point for this episode. Also, because I'm filthy, have no way currently of fixing it, so there's nothing in the game I can do until I find a way to fix that. I was planning on this being a one-off video, uh, but I've had fun with it. If you guys want me to do more, I, I'll do more. I'll happily do more. Uh, I'll see you with a new series very soon. And, uh, yeah. It's bad.